Peregrine, founded in 1996, has over 80 billion rand of assets under management. And indeed. And? Mm -hmm. and indeed, to its own asset management activities, hedge funds and so on. Remember, it has the equity trading business that's run by Warren Chapman. Also that's got Citadel and Stenham. Exactly. So those are private client businesses that form a part of the same umbrella. Jonathan Hertz, the CEO, and in the background, Mr. Sean Melnick, the founder, still the power behind the crown, I think. Market cap here, 6.6 .6 billion rand PE of 10.9, dividend yield of 5%. Yes. How does Peregrine stack up against the likes of PSG Consults, Investec Asset Management, Coronation? A bit of a different mix, so not as much asset management for third parties, a little bit more of a kind of a financial workshop going on inside. And certainly that equities execution business, understand what they do there is they're kind of like a hedge fund hotel. So they provide direct access to the market, technology, lending, clearing, settlement services for people who just want to sit and run hedge funds. That can be a very profitable business. Remember what happens when the markets get rough. Trading volatility goes up. Well, it goes up, but it's beneficial for the people that provide the direct access as opposed to... Let me try and make that clear. If you're running a hedge fund, right, and things are going well, then you toss a few people bones, you send them a bit of brokerage revenue here and there. When the market is not going well, then you revert to base and you do most of your trading with your core service provider. But again, provider. the volatility works in favor for the hedge funds, or is that too simplistic? Well, it works for a while, but if the volatility continues for too long, then the hedge funds blow up, then it's not good for anyone. Well, we're not there yet, so hot <laughs> or not on Peregrine. I like the guys, I like the management team. Uh, let's go back to the share chart, because it did well, and then it's kind of settled a little bit. Yeah, I give it the benefit of the doubt. I think Citadel uh, has held its client base well. Remember, they bought Canon in. So I think they continue to trade well on, on that one, yeah.